raining again. Uh, I'll hit a shot of the house that we're at. It's an older one, 1890s, and first good signal. Got a wheat scent. Not sure what the year is yet. It's like a 1930 something. 20s or 30s. All right. Well. Ah, it's crusty. All right, we'll keep going. All right, next target. Your penny is the impression. It's another wheat. Let's get a date on that. Another beautiful day in the Pacific Northwest. Let's see here. Come on, focus. I'll well, have it in the wrap up. Next target. Harmonica Reed. All right, let's keep going. Twelve forty six at three inches. Nice tight signal, just like we like it. Let's see if we can live dig this thing. <laughs> I'm not used to filming myself. Anyway, let's see what we got here. Ah, oh, Bazinga. Ah. Wow, that sounded so good. All right, on to the next. Next tone was a screamer. It's not silver. You can probably guess what it is. Yep. That, my friends, is the Illuminati. Let me unmask it real quick here. The dirt off of it. Looks shiny, but it's aluminum. There's the hole. Washington State tax token. Hit it. I uh, can't believe this. Uh, sorry guys, the homeowner is cutting some, uh, property on the side of the homestead here, so, sorry about the lawnmower noise, but, uh, check this out, you guys. I just popped another ring. No joke. It was down here in the roots. Probably about five inches down. It's right there. It looks like it's got some sort of a stone on it. Oh my gosh. Can't make this stuff up, you guys. Uh, I can tell right now this one's a junker, though. Looks cool, but it's broke. I think it's just a kid's junk ring. Might be gold plated or something, but anyway, I'll clean it up and we'll check it out. But yeah, I can tell it's plated right now. This copper plating's coming off. Pretty cool though. Oh, the stone's falling out. See that? There goes the stone. That's how you find these loose stones, you guys. They fall out of these junker rings sometimes. Where'd it go? I don't want to lose it. It's right there. All right. Anyway, we'll get this cleaned up and and uh, just verify it's a junker. All right. On to the next. Okay, guys. Just got that ring. Next hole. Look how deep this is. It's, this was down there about a foot deep. I got a silver coin. I just popped it out. It's a rosy. Wow, this has definitely been filled in. That's deep for a rosy. Alright, well, silver, silver. 
On to the next. Alright guys, just got that uh, silver rosy dime. I don't know what the date is yet, I haven't cleaned it up, but I just got another uh, medium tone here and I got a war nickel. You can see the impression right there. And uh, here's the nickel. That's definitely a war nickel. Let's see here. It's got a San Francisco mint. And the year. Okay, I might be able to see it there. This one's cleaning up kind of nice. Looks like a 43. Alright, cool. Been quite a day here. Alright, well, let's keep going. Hey guys, we're back at the uh, old um, floating saloon site. There's an 1800s floating saloon here on this uh, on this bay, saltwater bay. Anyway, this is where we find the old saloon tokens, and I thought I'd come down with the CTX with the big coil. Last time I was here, I had the stock coil, and we pretty much went through this, uh, Josh and I, until we couldn't find any more signals. But uh, came here with the big coil, and I got my first signal, and I think I got another token, guys. Check it out. Let's take it to the water. Let's clean this baby off. Oh yeah, it's a nice one. Oh, there's two. Oh, there's two stuck together. Check it out. They just separated my hand. Nice, two five cent. Saloon trade tokens stuck together. Wow. You can see, look at the color difference. That is awesome. I thought it felt kind of thick, kind of heavier than the other ones. Sweet. That is awesome. All right. Two more tokens from the site. All right, let's keep going. Got little Rosie over here. Oh, she's telling me to stand by. What'd you get? Hey, and not only did I find one token, but there was two. They were stuck together. Oh, really? Yeah. Two out of one. Two, yeah. Look at that. They're in awesome condition. Check that oh, out. that's really cool. Yeah. Good job, honey. All right. Well, let's keep nice. going. Hey, guys. Check this out. I have got a uh, token spill. So here's the two that I just pulled out. Right there. I... I covered the hole, ran my coil over again, got another deep low tone. Check this out right here, guys. Check it out. It's in the clump. They look like gold coins because of the salt water. They must be like brass. But check that out. There's another one. Sweet. Same thing. Nice. Cool, you guys. Check it out. That's three. Three in one hole. Love it. I'm going to keep going. I'll keep checking the for more signals. 1800 saloon tokens. Hit it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Check it out, you guys. Just popped another one. See it right here? Just broke open the clump. And there it is. So there's a five right there. Good for five cents in trade. Nice. That's four. Let's keep going. We've pounded this beach here, so I'm telling you, the CTX with this 17-inch coil is just doing a killer job today on this beach. Let's keep going and see how many we can find. Holy cow, guys. I got another one. This is five. I just lost it, too. These things blend. <laughs> Where'd it go? Oh, right there. Looks like a gold coin. <laughs> Check it out. It's another one. Nice. Yeah. There's the five. Five tokens we're up to. 25 cents. Yeah. That's a lot of booze at the saloon. 
All right, let's keep going. We're gonna get... Just pretty much every low tone that I'm getting has been a token with the CTX today. This thing's on fire. We went over this thing with the E-Track, CTX, the AT Gold. And I know there's been other people. There's been someone here with a Fisher. I'm telling you, man, there's still a lot of tokens here. It's never hunted out. No. I just got another one right here. Might want well to just keep this thing rolling. Another five cent tax token. Man, starting to get kind of old now. Hit it. I don't know. What do you think it is? It's right here. Looks yeah. Another one. Another one. There's the saloon name, and there's the five. Is it all the same saloon? Yeah, same saloon. Boy, that was a hopping, yeah. drinking saloon. I have found a little silver here. I found a burnt up uh, silver half dollar. Um, it was a barber half. And uh, I found a 1920, I think, mercury dime. No, uh, 1918 mercury dime. So this, there's coins here and stuff, but. So this used to be an old logging town. Yeah, this was a floating saloon right here and it burnt down. And uh, obviously the loggers came to the saloon after work. Yeah, they cast in their tokens. Oh, another one. Got another one, honey. I found one too. You did? On the surface? Check it out. On the surface? Yeah. Get out of here. Did you Check really? it out. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I wrote five on it. <laughs> it's a good one, man. Right there. Ooh. Yeah. There's a five. All right, cool. I think mine is the authentic one. <laughs> yeah. This might have got you a beer. This might have shown you. shown you the door. Kicked out. Yeah! <laughs> Good job. I'm gonna try it though, I guess. <laughs> hey. Try and find them together. So Andrew found three more tokens, and he left the hole open for us. So the viewers and I are gonna get to find them. I see one right off the bat. That was an easy one. Ooh, this one's been dented. It's got a hole right there. Just a dent, not a hole. You know what I mean. All right, so let's see. There's one right there. Ooh, yeah. That's a nice one. Clean up good. All right, third one. Ooh, I see it. Third one's not as easy. Right here. That's a nice one. Cool. Thank you. Keeping these. Oh! All right, try and keep you out of the wind here. We've got another token. Let's see if I can find it. That's right there. That was pretty deep. It was down about nine inches down. Let's over the water. Keep going. Watch out for the glass. A lot of broken old bottles and stuff here. And I got a silver tone, guys, and check it out. See it in the hole? 
I think I got a silver coin. Yeah, it's a mercury. That's a mercury dime. Salt water's got it turned black. Might be able to get a date off that. You can see the the outline there. Ooh, my big old finger in the way. All right, cool. First silver. Right behind you is where I found that uh, 19, I think it was a 1918 Mercury last time we were here. Wow, I cannot see in the sun. There we go. Yeah. Very nice. Fist bump for sure. Damn, cool. Woohoo. Good job. Thanks. Okay, hold on, put the wind eye down. It's really blowing. I was just walking behind uh, little Rosie back to the trail. And I just got a bang, 11.45 solid right here, small tight. I just dug down about five inches. Check it out. It's definitely, looks like it's going to be another silver coin. See, it got that gray patina to it right here. Let's pluck it out and see what we got. Oh, yeah. I, I think I can see the torch in the back. I think it's another mercury dime. Yeah, it's a mercury. See the face, the buster. Nice. Two mercuries today. Yeah, that's two. Like within the hour. Okay, guys, let's do a real quick wrap up here because this weather's coming in fast. Um, so I just popped that mercury dime. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve saloon tokens and two silver dimes. You mean 13 saloon tokens. Where's the other one? Oh, yeah. <laughs> 12 saloon tokens and two Merc dimes. I'll try to get close-up shots of the dates. And we'll see what the dates are on the dimes. Alright, cool. On to the next. <laughs>